got a new show for y'all. Got a damn good show. Damn good show. Yeah, um, I, I believe in protesting. I believe got, in protesting. But it's got to make sense. Right to assemble. Peacefully yeah. protest. It's got to make sense, though. Yeah, it's got to make sense. That's why this country is so great. You know? Yeah. To give y'all some context. Without your First Amendment right, man, this country would be chaos, man. You know that, right? Yeah. You know, in China, you try to protest. They just run you over with a tank. You know the image of that woman? Is, she's like this. It was a man, I think. Woman, man, I don't know what it was, but Maybe tank ran man. over. I don't think that the tank actually ran him over. No, the tank ran her over, turned her into hamburger meat. She was 100% fresh ground meat. So count your blessings you live in the freest country in the world. Yeah, but I'm just saying when you protest, it's got to make sense. But I you could I'm... be Chinese living in China. Hey, man, you going to cut me off? You know, I'm trying to make a point over here. I mean, but I, I guess some people call this brave and a lot of courage, but uh oh, it's got to make sense. I'm going to show you the first video. I ain't seen the video. Yeah, you ain't seen this. He's a, that's a preacher, and he's like protesting at a gay pride parade or something. He's actually a preacher. He's got a Jesus, a Jesus shirt. He's, pre he's preaching the word of God, and you can't even hear him with all that music, all that butt clapping. Yeah, that girl. Hey, man, that's the fearless woman I'm gonna say to my life. Like that. I mean, I understand. Wait, this is not an effective protest. <laughs> He's trying to preach the word of God. He ain't trying to hear that. These people want to burn in hell for eternity. All right, turn it off. I had enough. I don't even know what that was. What was that? Was that a man or woman? I don't know. I think it was a man who had titties. Man titties. You're literally in the um, the pit of hell. You're literally in the balls of Satan. <laughs> You're literally inside of the anus of Satan. <laughs> yeah. For a protest to be effective, man. Well, he's you not gotta... protest. He's trying to spread the word of God. He's not, I don't uh, think he's really protest. He's trying to enlighten him, open the eyes to God. No, he's protesting. But he's he's preaching the word of God, but he's protesting that lifestyle. Yeah. You know what's funny? Christians, we are protesting, and we are not a, a down with this, and this radical fringe gender ideology they're pushing in public schools now. We're not behaving like this to uh, gay people, but they behave this way when— Someone, you know, with our beliefs, try to push it on them. Look how they behave. Totally different. Just wanted to point that out. Let's go to the next video. It's another one? Yeah. I don't right. want to look at these homos. Well, just, yeah. I mean, it's nothing wrong with being gay. I love conservative gays because it's such, it's such thing as a good gay and a bad gay. These are all bad gays. They're a detriment to the, to the gay race. Let's go to the next video. I don't understand why you're good at that. These people are nearly ill. Trans rights equals Bitcoin. A whole lot of cute little black girls out there. What are they doing? Oh, that's assault right there. I don't even know why you would fix yourself in that uh, situation. It's not like you can change minds, man. <laughs> she don't be defend. I mean, she's standing up for women's rights. You could do that on YouTube, in inside the safe confines of your home, man. I don't know how people put themselves in that. Uh, yeah, you're not gonna make a difference doing that. That's like me going to a Klan rally and saying, "Hey, man, what a sign! God created us all. Yeah, you know, love is love." Well, yeah. I won't say that. It comes off homosexual. I ain't gonna say that. Oh, he's one of them homosexuals. I mean, I don't think Klan, I think the Klan's still out there somewhere. It's not too many members, but I'm sure they have some. Like There's a, a lot of them. Do you remember what happened in Charlottesville? Did you? <laughs> There's a lot of white supremacists out there. Yeah, but uh, I mean, but it's very minute statistically across yeah, but America. but was all those white supremacists? Trump said there was good people there. <laughs>
<laughs> he wasn't talking about the white supremacists. I know, man. I'm just being facetious. <laughs> <laughs> it was good people on both sides. Yeah. Yeah. People took his words out of context. <clears throat> yeah. He says, you're putting your life in harm's way. Yeah. I mean, these people are literally mentally ill. Yeah. You have a, a much better response if you, you know, put out content across social media. When you go to that, when you go there to protest and you're trying to preach something to them, the loud music and all the distractions, they can't even hear your message. And you got to be willing to listen to your message. They don't care about Christianity. They don't care about any of that because what God said them about in their book, uh, they don't like God. Yeah, and I'm sure these gay people don't like God because he, he, he was talking trash to these people. God said he's going to burn them at the stake. Yeah. Put gasoline on them, burn them. Yeah. God ain't playing with these people. When God comes, God's going to chop that genitals off, going to keep them alive, and he's going to start burning them right down the grill. And he's going to be doing the holy sacrament and all. <laughs> going to be throwing that holy water on him. <laughs> hey, he's going to be, drink this, you <laughs> sinner. <laughs> He go, drink it. He's going to have a grill, right? He's going to have a grill just grilling all their penises, right? And what? then they're going to get nice and hard and burnt. Then they're going to take the penis off the grill and throw it in the face. <laughs> <laughs> and then with that, he's going to throw it in the face. And you're a doomed hell. He's going to start burning. Man, you preaching hate in here. No, I'm just saying. So it's not for you. To, it's not okay for you to say that politics is these homos. I'm just, God can say it because he created everything. He, he gets to make the rules, but you can't do that. What do you say in the Bible? Thou without sin should cast the first brick. That's what he said, right? <laughs> first stone, I think. No, a cinder block. Brick or cinder block. That's what he said. That's crazy what I say, right? Yeah. God's going to get them and, and cut off the penises and fry them on the grill and just torture them. And... Oh, man, God is not a Nazi. Well, he did drown everybody. He built a boat and he said, all right, the rain's coming. <laughs> <laughs> I can't swim for some reason. I can swim, but for some reason, I can't swim. <laughs> hey, he put them damn currents in there. What? He put them currents in there. <laughs> he put them damn uh, rib currents in there. <laughs> rib currents? <laughs> what do you call them? A rib current. A uh, rib current. <laughs> the water pipe by, by, high, by waist high? He put them rib currents in there. <laughs> <laughs> Feel like this in the whirlpool. <laughs> Hey, but I just want to point out, you know how, look how respectful we are to the homosexuals when they want to push their ideology. We're not doing anything crazy like yeah, this. Look yeah. how they treat when there's just a different message, a different opinion. They, they are. Yeah. Like they, the gay, like during the gay month, the mm -hmm. gay month, you got flags everywhere. I can't wait before it's over, man. man. I can't wait. Like all the flags everywhere, right? Let's how do you get your own flag, man? Fuck you. I'm trying to make a point. You keep talking over me. Like, you got your flags everywhere, right? Just put one picture of Jesus in one of their gay bars. They would go off. See what I'm saying? Yeah, y'all actually you took that flag. Right? Y'all see what you said? You took that, those flags, those colors. is biblical. That's what I hear, huh? The yeah. Rainbow? That's biblical, huh? Yeah, it's biblical. They made it in the, um, used to be love, true love. Now it's just, well, y'all still, well, fine. They do love each other. They love each other too much. They love each other so much they chopping dicks off and chopping off titties. Yeah, I mean, I'm not talking about all that. I'm just talking about they actually love each other. I, want to get I don't think they love each other. I think deep down they hate themselves. Anybody that says they're proud about something, I'm black and I'm proud. I'm a homo and I'm proud. Anybody's got to say that out loud, you really don't mean that. You're trying to convince yourself you try that to, you like yourself. <laughs> you're trying to gaslight yourself. Yeah, you're gaslighting yourself. I'm not proud to be a straight person. Just, I'm just proud that I can have sex. It's just weird celebrating a person's sexuality. Uh, what I know, I'm not a homosexual. Hey, we got a new giveaway going. Give away a Ford Raptor. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go to officialhogstwins.com. Anything you buy from the site gets you automatically into the win, and when you win. You get $10,000 of cold, hard, white American cash. <laughs> yeah.